I am so sorry. I am devastated. I am really, really upset about this whole thing. Here the hails I go again. Out in the middle of Cleveland to pick up a storage unit like a lone wolf. George took another me day. Can you believe it? Psych! Oh, <laughs> she gotcha. You know, she gotcha. Happy Friday, everyone. So we got this unit for $40 Hold downtown Cleveland. I just noticed we're what? wearing the same color top. Hey, <laughs> hails low that we are. Planned. <laughs> Not planned at all, but hey, still happened. You ready to go dig into this unit? Let's do it. Let's find out what treasure we can find. And hey, if you haven't subscribed yet, what the hells are you waiting for? Do it. All the cool kids are. Do it. Do you have any idea the history of the individual or how long they had it or um, what the deal was? This, let me see. Um, I thought for sure I saw a guitar case in there too. It could be fabric to something else, but I was hoping like crazy it was a guitar case. And with some of the with some of the items in there, I thought m musical, musician. Oh, oh. Um, but I could be completely wrong too. Do you buy storage units? Yeah. Lot? Yep. He's been here uh, for almost two years. Oh, so two years, and then all of a sudden, yeah. automatic payments stop. But he did come in and try and paid. Um, he. Um, huh. Looks like he owed 170. The last payment that we had from him, he came in and paid. Okay, so he paid in person last time. Yeah, yeah. With the, with the credit card, and then he said a lot of pay, which I don't know. That sounds silly, but it means a lot when you have customers. Oh, who don't sure, have when you have cards yeah, and who, yeah. who have to come in and pay Especially cash if you came in. So. Don't have email addresses and. I kind of figured musician, but. Who knows if I'm going to be right or not. I thought there was a guitar in there. I'm really hoping. Well, you don't have to let me know. I, um, I, always, I always love um, hearing how people do. We'll let you know what we find. Okay. I told the guys they have to do with me today is push me down and so I Go can check each, out each one. We're looking. Someone took off with one of our dollies. Oh, dolly, no. Or has it in their unit. So oh. um, we got to try and play detective today. <laughs> I usually bring a broom to sweep them out, but I'm not sure I can sweep that one out. <laughs> it shouldn't be too Just bad. Dust brush it. Well, it was all totes. Um, yeah, yeah. 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 Um. And I hope a guitar. I really do hope a guitar. That's why I bought it. I thought there was just an edge that looked like a guitar case edge with the with the fabric stitching with when they stitch the leather together mm -hmm. and I thought oh man it's just hidden behind those totes and I thought maybe so we're gonna find out if I was right or not the manager opened the actual unit for us that we paid 40 bucks for now this is I the first unit that's up on the second level. are you afraid of heights a little bit well I'm afraid that there may not be a guitar in there. What's your guess? Is there a guitar? I have to see the unit. I haven't even seen the unit yet. Okay. So. Put your guess down below, viewers. Is there a guitar? If we look at this picture right here, this is why I bid on the unit. Down here, at the lower right hand corner, you see what looks like a guitar case. Now notice the white box is in the middle of other boxes. We're here at the unit, opening the unit and this box is displaced and the guitar case is gone. So now we're gonna have to go figure out what in the world is going on. The manager opened the actual unit and as you can see, the guitar case is missing, which would have been right here. This box, which was over there, has now been displaced up to here. This is not what we bid on. And therefore, we're gonna have to go figure something out. I got bad news. It is not as it was pictured. The guitar is actually gone and the boxes are displaced. You're kidding. Not oh kidding. Alright, let me um... Not kidding, unfortunately. The reason why I bought it isn't there anymore. Unfortunately. No, I understand that. I understand that hundred percent. And I'm so sorry. Um so sorry that that happened. Um 
I, I may have to just do all of the auctions myself tomorrow. Oh, you have another employee taking care of them? Mm -hmm. yeah. Well, yeah, I have, I have one employee who cuts the locks yeah. and then another um, office staff member who takes the inventory and pictures. Looks like they took the guitar. Yeah, well, I think I, I think, we'll see, let me pull up those pictures. Okay. Can I come over there with you to look oh, at the pictures? Yeah. Okay, so if you expand that picture, that first one. So, okay, see this right here? Whoop. Go, go ahead and get off the magnif... Right there. This is the guitar case. Okay, this I, is I'm why... going to tell you, I'm going to be very honest with you. Yeah. I found that in our maintenance room. I found that in one of our rooms a, a few days, uh, like a week or two ago. Are you serious? And, I, and I'm like, what, what is this doing here? So and, that's and, why I bid and, on it. Okay, well, you can have it. It's at my house. I didn't do anything with it. I'm just, I had to figure out what I was going to do with it or who you I was You found it in the maintenance room. In the maintenance room. Uh -huh. Gotcha. So, I will get to the bottom of it. Um, yeah, that's, and this I'll is. Bring it, and I'll bring it back. I never even opened it. It's, this is the whole reason why I bid right I here. I never even opened for it. For the musical instrument. I never even opened it. You were right. Um, so what happened is somebody took this box, moved it over. They took the instrument out, the guitar out. They moved this box up here. Everything else looks like it in in the picture. For, I didn't look. Honestly, the only thing I'm really looking for, I was looking for the guitar. That's why I bid. Well, if you want, you can, um, you can, uh, I can, I can put a lock back on it and put a tag back on it. And I got some work to do. My my well, only I, issue I mean, is I'm an hour and a half away. I'd st um, if you've got the guitar, I'd still like the if unit. If you want to take this stuff out, yeah, I will bring you the guitar. I am so sorry. I am devastated. I am really, really upset about this whole thing. I will not allow anyone else to do auctions ever again. Okay. We'll go I've load heard up. Nothing's happening to other storage facilities. I mean, from a sure. horror stories from other storage facilities that people have told me. Yeah. You know, that, um, and no, I don't do that. In fact, I replaced the manager here when I came on board, who was a yeah. huge thief. What the hails just happened? So we want to know in the comments below, who do you think stole it? Was it the manager, hails yes, or somebody else, hails no? She says she found it in the maintenance room. It's the only reason why I bid, because I love guitars. And she's driving an hour to go get it. Only us. This stuff only <laughs> happens to Why? us. Why? All right, George, you're getting your first look. What do you see? Or I guess more importantly, what do you not see? What do I not see? Was that guitar case you couldn't stop talking about on the way here to get the unit. Okay, well, what do you see now? Now I just see boxes and here's a black bag. Looks like towels. All right. A well, ton of stuff. How about you hand stuff down to me, we'll get it down on the floor, and we'll try and figure out what's inside. What do you say? Let's do it. <laughs> George is giggling while we're trying to show you everything. This is all that's in here. This is what we got to find out what's inside. $40 worth. Let's see. Open it up. All right. Box number one. It does not look like a guitar. Here's oh. a jacket with the tag still on is it. Is that a timber? It's a 4X. Timber King. Look at what the price it? tag on it. Sixty-five dollars. There you go. We paid Forex. forty bucks for this. I could wear that. That's how big I am. You do like your clothes baggy. I love my clothes baggy. Oh, the All right. Well, she got in there. Oh, there's some more. There's another jacket. Is it new? Man, if it's new, we got big money. This one's a two X. Oh, that's a two X. You could wear that. I wouldn't be able to find you, but. <laughs> Some more jackets. What's underneath the jackets? This one's a large. What's under there? We got, looks like some speakers and some household goods. What you got now, George? Here's a, uh, a tote that has I'm burning up because I got robbed. That's why I'm burning up. Uh, by the way, just a little side note for you guys. When you buy units, make sure you bring the pictures with you and match it up. Yeah, or take screenshots. Of screenshots, it or something. something. So luckily for us, the Some one thing pieces. that I actually wanted, we were able to tell really quick that it had been gone through. 
who would have thought a ton of the person seeds. who went through it is the person everyone's supposed to trust. Yeah, there's a ton of CDs. We got more clothes under there. That one says talk. Piping? Piping? I don't know. <laughs> Piping. Glockle Groove. All right, well, it looks like clothes underneath there. Can you just dig really quick? Mm -hmm. Fight diseases with your fork. We need to start eating healthy. Okay. Cheeseburgers and bacon it is. Why did you make me 10 strips of bacon last night? It wasn't 10, it was 12, it was a dozen, a baker's dozen. It's 13. I tried cooking bacon in the oven for the first she time the because first your one. stove top is all out of whack for some reason. Anything in here at all? This is like a bunch of, oh, I'm sure there's Bitcoin on there. Yeah. Yep. All of our subscribers will tell us, check it for Bitcoin. I doubt there's Bitcoin there's on anything in stuff. here. Baby. Do you hear me knocking? Keep on knocking, but you can't come in. What is this? I just want a kiss. Don't you hear me knocking? Can I have a kiss? <laughs> oh, you massage. know what that is, don't you? You know what that is. Mm-hmm. Uh, you might want to put gloves on. I, I just flipped my gloves. Okay. I have... Oh, cashmere vintage Louis Vuitton clothing. Ooh, don't smell it. If we only had smell of vision you guys... <laughs> somebody smoked mothballs. Somebody really loved mothballs. You smell mothballs? Moth <laughs> yeah, I smell them without more than just mothballs. I think someone even went to the potty on that too. Okay, I saw I saw Grimes Fimes do an entire episode like this. Bird box. Blind. He did the bird box Blind. challenge. Blind. Okay. Um, this has got to be silk. Silk. No, this is a kite. This is a kite. Yeah. This is. You're a right. Kite. Mixed so you, in with the the tote labeled that's clothing. A kite. And I give up. We found the name of the previous owner. So George went outside to where there's reception to actually see what she could find. I got a bunch of boxes of books. Here we go. Here's the Bible, King James. Oh, we saw something right there. And what is it? Oh, it's a bunch of verses. I am. So, this looks like all religious books, and here we have, we have Alcohols Anonymous. This is pretty typical of pretty much every, every storage unit. You find something that has to do with AA. Now, that doesn't mean it was him, personally, but... Could have been a close person, or maybe he was working with alcoholics. Health knowledge. We have a feeling he passed away with no family. There's another Bible. Okay, I've got more books here. There's a dictionary. Philosophies and opinions of Marcus Gra Gravely. What do we have here? Oh, look at this. Okay. So, Harlem Renaissance, Art of Black America. So, I bought a unit, oh man, it must have been four years ago. It had all kinds of black history, just incredible uh, documentation of history. Those books were worth thousands, thousands of dollars. So, this thing right here, number one, cool for history. And number two, incredible as far as profit margin. So don't ever discount your books. Make sure you're always checking them. And let's see what else we have here. Okay. We've got The Power of Concentration, A Course in Miracles, Manual 3 for Teachers. Uh, got all kinds of things. The Known and Unknown Life of Jesus Christ. I'm not sure how you write about the unknown, if it's unknown. Lots of, lots of health, both physical health and 
spiritual health. I just grabbed a knife from the truck. That way we can use it in a bit. It looked like you had a knife mustache when you had that up towards your face. Oh. That was awesome. Try that again. Yep. Like this? No, a little bit. Tilt, tilt, tilt. To keep tilting. Look. Like well, yeah, don't move. Don't move. Move your head that way. Ooh, it looks like you got 352 X's. Is that true, George? You have 352 X's? No, but you have 3,001. <laughs> <laughs> George is going to town, knifing Whoa. everything. More burned CDs. Death, death row. I wonder if that tells any part of the story. Okay. What else we got? I bet this is probably going to be more. I think that's going to be burned as well. Burned CDs. You want to know what the giveaway was? What? The marking on the box. The marking on the box. Siddas? Mm hmm. Siddas. It says Siddas. Yep, I was right. Is it all burned? It all looks burned. Oh, man. All right, what do we got over here? Knife it, George. Knife it. Get in there. Knife that thing. And more burns. Oh, oh wait, wait, there's no, actually not some. All burned. There might be something of value in there's there. There's a vont. I don't know what a vont is, but R and B. Believe in Church of Christ. What's in box number ten? Oh, I bet it's burnt. VHS tapes. VHS tapes. It's burnt VHS tapes. That's exactly what I was going to guess. Homemade VHS tapes. You know what we always find on the homemade ones? Full disclosure. Get it, George. Look at our main candle in boxes. And more burn CDs. Yes. Gospel exactly choirs. So it's a mixture. Alright, so it's in her car and we're waiting for it. It's definitely the guitar key.